What's up guys, Hackadoo 1940 here and I'm bringing you NHL 14 Hut Roulette, this is episode 5 and as you can see I just won once again, I won the Division 9 title um, so yeah so far in the series we are 4-0 or at least on this account um, so that's pretty cool I beat this guy 2-0 as you can see uh, another shutout for Robin Laner. So doing really good for me. Made 19 saves. I got 20 shots in goal. Two goals. Time of attack 751 to 351. Um, I will show you the goals now. It's already on there. Um, I'm going to show all. There we go. Here's Ryan Close's goal. This was the second goal of the game. You can see he just went through the whole defense. He just took the puck on, on the side of the, the ice there and then just took it to the front. He just used his big body. Forehand, backhand, right past I mean Varlamov. Big goal there for Ryan Klo. That put the icing on the cake. And then the first goal was a shorthanded goal by, who else? Montgomery. Came in on a breakaway, again with the forehand, backhand. Slid it past Varlamov. Varlamov just couldn't take those forehand, backhands. What can I say? I'm telling you, I'm loving Montgomery. I'm loving that, that first line. And Ryan Klo in his first game scored a big goal. So, pretty good game. Um, so, yeah, 20 shots on goal. So it will be the last player on the second page that we pick up. Let's hopefully add to our team. Hopefully it's it's a defenseman or possibly a player who can play in the top line. Um, that'd be nice. Um, so far we've gotten real lucky. Four pulls and we got a starting goalie and two left wingers. So uh, gotten really lucky so far. We can now put this by now minimum to 4,000. Which is pretty awesome. We eliminated all those bronze players, and we picked the last player on the second page. There is 10, and the 20th player is Jonas Hiller. Ooh, some goalie controversy in this Hot Roulette series. Ooh, that's interesting. All right, so let's go ahead and buy the cheapest Jonas Hiller on the market. Oh, let's drop this just in case there's one cheaper than 4K. I doubt there is. I think he goes for around 5 to 6K, oh, just in case... Well, leave us in the comments below, actually. What what team do you think Jonas Hiller will sign with? I think he's going to sign with Winnipeg. Uh, that's what I've been hearing a lot. Um, I know there are a lot of Winnipeg fans who would love Jonas Hiller, I've heard. So, um, yeah, he's he's Norwegian, isn't he? I think he is. Or no, he's Swiss. He's Swiss. Yeah, I remember. 5.25. Uh, Looks like 5K is the cheapest. I will take that. He's actually boosted. Um doesn't really matter, but, but yeah, like I said, goalie controversy, I mean, Robin Lander, he's 4-0, he's gotten a few shutouts, so, so actually, was it a shutout in every single game? I'll have to check that later, but, um, but yeah, um, actually, how many games, does he have any duration on him? No, it's just one game duration, he boosted his high stats, so, send him my active roster, so, uh, let me know in the comments, guys, should I stick with, uh, well, first thing to leave in the comments, first of all, um, uh, where do you think Jonas Hiller will sign? And second, who should I play in net for the next game, Jonas Hiller or Robin Lehner? Robin lehner has been hot for me, but, uh, you know, Jonas Hiller, I mean, he's he's nine overalls better, so, I don't know, I, I haven't usually had luck with the, the right-handed goaltenders, but, um, now what should we do? Should we replace Lander with, um, with Hiller, or should we stick with what's working? Let me know, boys. I will see you in the next episode.